Now, Central Oregon's local alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Bob Shaw. 21 minutes before the hour on this Tuesday morning. And if you're headed south on 97, just realize that by the time you get to Lava Butte, certainly by Sun River, you're going to be hitting some snow on the roads and uh, points south from there are going to stay fairly icy. So be careful with that. Most of the rest of our streets are in pretty good shape this morning. 27 degrees at the Bend Airport. That breeze out of the southwest has backed off to five miles per hour and uh, still at seven miles per hour at the Redmond Airport uh, where it is 29 degrees this morning. So a chilly morning, but really not out of the ordinary. What is out of the ordinary are our daytime highs and they're going to feel like yesterday. So uh, just be prepared for another blustery kind of cold day here on the high desert. And that's mainly because we're getting a lot of cold air coming down the British Columbia coastline right into the Pacific Northwest. Yes, there is a bit of moisture embedded within this, uh, so we're looking at scattered showers in western Washington and now much of western uh, Oregon. We've had some snow in the Cascades and likely we're going to get some more out of this system before it's done. Future track model shows our skies um, being uh, under this variable cloud cover here for the next couple of days. We may push through a few scattered snow showers throughout the day, so be prepared for a little slick street later in the day. Mount Bachelor expecting two to four inches of fresh snow out of this today. We get a bit of high pressure on Wednesday. It won't clear our skies entirely, but it will give us a little better condition. It'll also introduce a warming trend that will carry us into some very pleasant temperatures. We just have a couple of stormy days to get through. In fact, it looks like we'll cling to a chance of some scattered showers right through uh, with our workday on Friday. So the next two or three days will be a little bit uncomfortable. Scattered through the 20s right now around Central Oregon and not a great deal of wind. Lapine breezes have picked up a little bit. All of us get a little gusty later in the day. Those westerly winds will pick up to 5 to 15 miles per hour. In some areas, they'll see gusts as high as 20 to 25 miles per hour. So just be aware that uh, the breezes and temperatures are going to feel a lot like they did yesterday. Highs will be in the mid-30s to mid-40s. Overnight lows tonight expected to be a little bit colder. We'll be in mid-teens to mid-20s, so another cold night here on the high desert. I guess uh, the good news here is that the warming trend actually starts tomorrow. By the time we get into Thursday and Friday, yes, we have that chance of showers, but we'll be topping out in the mid-50s, near 60 on Saturday, and mid 60s on Sunday, uh, mostly clear skies on Monday and around 70 degrees. So that's going to be good, good news.